Why Media Group? The fastest growing media group in North America. West Indies knocked England out of the Women's T20 World Cup with a six-wicket victory in Dubai, securing their spot in the semi-finals at the Dubai International Cricket Stadium. West Indies, who had not defeated England since 2018, ended a 13-game losing run and won Group B to advance to the Sharjah semi-finals, where they will face New Zealand. West Indies' final appearance in the 2020 World Cup semi-final occurred in that same year. After being eliminated in the group stage of the 2010 T20 World Cup, this is only the second time England has failed to advance past the knockout stages. They were optimistic about reaching the final four times around after winning their first three games. South Africa replaces England in the West Indies after England's net run rate drops them to the third position in the group, chasing a target of 142 West Indies captain Haley Matthews and opener. Keep your mobile plan priced forever, starting at $14 a month with Fizz. Shana Joseph set the stage, with explosive half-centuries leading their side to a memorable win over the world's number 2 team. West Indies reached 89 with a loss of 0 wickets after 10 overs, with Matthews and Joseph unleashing a flurry of boundaries. Their partnership consisting of 12 fours and 3 sixes left England completely stunned. Despite losing both their openers in quick succession, West Indies stayed composed. Diane draws Dotton's 27 from 19 balls and some crucial contributions from Shimani Campbell and Ali Allen guided West Indies home with ease as Allen hit the winning runs in the 18th over. Why Media Group? The fastest growing media group in North America.